Alright guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna show you guys how to install the latest Pixel Launcher from Android P. So Android P is the upcoming Android version. So you basically you're gonna go to this link. I'm gonna send you guys the link to download the uh, new Pixel Launcher from Android P. So Pixel devices should already be able to get the uh, Android developers preview. But if non-Pixel devices you can't, so you you can download the launcher however. So you can see you have a download link here, you can just tap on it and it will take you to this uh, media fire page but before we're going to do this, I'm going to show you guys uh, uh, how to uh, enable uh, unknown sources uh, download for your device so first, if you're using uh, Android 8.0 or your and above uh, if you're using like my Galaxy S8, something like this you want to go to settings and go to apps and you're gonna find Chrome, which is your browser. You're gonna download the APK file. So let's go down and find uh, Chrome, which should be somewhere here. There we go. And you wanna go. You wanna slow scroll down to the advanced section. You can see here we have install other apps. Make sure this is allowed, so that you can download uh, APK files from Chrome. All right. So once this is done, you can switch back to your uh, MediaFire page. And you're gonna click on download and you should pop up and just click OK so it's downloading now you can see the APK file is downloading it's pretty small so it should be fast and it should be done so you can tap on it to open and install it so just hit install it should begin installation and done so the pixel launcher has been installed so now you're gonna wanna hit the uh, home button so you're gonna press the home button you can see oh it didn't trigger so you have to go to settings if it didn't trigger you can go to settings go to the apps and find your pixel launcher so pixel launcher should be installed let me see where is it pixel launcher there we go and scroll down until you find home screen so you can see it's set uh, by default to my samsung experience home screen you can change to pixel launcher and now you're going to tap the home button you'll see we have changed to the pixel launcher now you can see so this is the new uh, pixel launcher you can swipe up to see your apps similar to the old ones and you can obviously uh, call on the google assistant you can tap on google now and obviously this is the uh, calendar and you can pinch out to, the, to go to the settings and you can enable home screen rotation if you want <clears throat> and we have notification dots so you can enable this but you have to go to uh, settings and change it and make sure you enable notification access for the pixel launcher so i'm gonna allow it and show you guys how it, it works all right so you can see we have a blue dot over here which means it's, it is it is working actually and you can long press on icons to take you to some shortcuts you can see with my apps you have uh, notifications you can clear them off and for chrome um, same thing you can create a new tab you have uh, app information and obviously these are the, the app widgets you can add as well and let's just go to the my apps and i'm going to show you guys what happens if i update my apps you can see we should have a blue dot uh, pretty shortly so you can see uh, yeah it's downloading now All right you can see we have a blue dot I'm installing the app oops sorry you can see it does installing something you show here so that's it's all the features of the pixel launcher is working on my s8 which is nice i'm not sure about other devices whether it's working fine um heard that the note 8 force closes uh when installing the pixel launcher i'm not sure about the uh the their older devices or any other device besides the samsung with the device let me know in the comments if yours works you can see landscape mode works fine so yeah guys that's pretty much it on how to install the pixel launcher uh, from android p on your latest uh, device or on your android device i mean so yeah thank you guys for watching uh, hopefully this video helped and i'll see you guys in another video peace out